Hey guys, and welcome back. It's a Fire Emblem Three Houses. Professor, you would raise your sword against me? Well, technically, you did, and I just kind of retaliated. Your mother lies here, waiting for us, waiting for you. Don't you want her back? Teach, is that true, or is he just trying to freak us out? If so, <laughs> it's kind of working. <laughs> Shut up, Quad. Uh, my mom died to give me life. I don't have a mom. Well, that's rather odd. Uh, you have no proof that's her. I mean, he knows better than us. Uh, this just does It's not natural, though, man. And killing people to bring her back, that's effed up. These are like your kids, Alfred. You're a douche. There is no room for doubt. I know her appearance better than anyone. This is her. It's totally not what we're talking about, but all right. An upstanding nun who married Gerald. She died 21 long years ago. You cannot expect us to believe that someone who died two decades ago is still in such pristine condition. Incredible, isn't it? It's as though she remains untouched even after all these years. Perhaps her body differs from others. Beautiful, ageless, perfectly preserved by some secret only she knows. Can you, like, not talk about my mom that way? That'd be nice. Whatever the case may be, it is strange, is it not? It's been ten long years since I found her. I came across her body, frozen in time, deep underground. I have worked tirelessly to solve the riddle of her death and bring her back to life. Halt, Elfric. Rhea, you are the cause of this. It was you who killed her when she gave birth to a child who made no sound. Tell me what you've done to her. Why does her body remain while her spirit does not? I owe you no words on the matter. But I will tell you this. But Rhea, you just said... Uh, she made the choice to die. That her offspring might live. I respected her will. Nothing more. Elfric, just as I viewed her, so do I view you. You are as my own child. Please, cease this futility. Oh! <laughs> what is that sound? Oh! You expect that I should believe you without question? I mean, she was there to see it. Uh... You see her lying here before you, and yet you owe no words. Rhea, I am finished with you. The only thing that remains to be done is to complete the ritual. Hurry. He cannot have gone far. Yes, we must stop him at once. Let's figure out where he disappeared to. What about you four? You don't look like you're up for much of anything right now. It'll take a lot more than that to stop me. If anything, I feel speedier with less blood weighing me down. <laughs> Probably for the best that he drained us. Otherwise, our blood would be boiling. Ugh, speak for yourselves. I feel atrocious. We must end this, and swiftly. Count me in. We're all on the same page. But first things first. Let me see that pretty face of yours, boss. Balthus, now is not the time. Mm -hmm. Jesus Christ, this game. It's so Oh, he <sighs> punched him! Well, color me surprised! <laughs> Why the hell didn't you tell us? Oh, I'm sorry I had to use you all, but there wasn't much choice. Someone would have died for sure otherwise. It could have been any of you. It could have been one of my rogues. Someone from Abyss. Who knows? You imply that you didn't trust us enough. I am incensed by you, Yuri. Use me or don't, but it would have been nice if you'd asked us first. Look, I get it. Your people were being held hostage. You were between a rock and a hard place. But I thought we were pals. Buddies till the end. I... I need you. All of you. I've been a fool. Thank you for always being here for me. Even now. Alright, I think this fool gets the picture. Time to find that other fool and take him down. You'll help with that, yeah? Uh... I guess. Yeah, why not? <laughs> I love the lip on this one. <laughs> Let's do this, wolves. To me, growing up in the shelter of the monastery, she was my world. All of the memories I hold of her. Learning, growing, walking hand in hand, 
She left me in awe. If that's what makes her happy, then I will watch her walk away with warmth in my heart. If that is truly what will make her happy, surely he will make her smile. That's all I wanted for her. That's really sweet and all, but man, you... Uh, I'm uncomfy. To Citri, confined within the monastery walls, he was her world. I saw the way her eyes glimmered when they spoke, and her otherworldly smile when they became engaged. The look on her face when she told me how happy she was to bear his child. It was enough for me to see her happiness, to witness it from a distance. She breathed her last. 21 long years ago. I have never forgotten. She died before she could see the face of the child whom she had so lovingly nurtured. The funeral was a solemn affair. We gathered in the graveyard, said our farewells, and watched as her casket was lowered into the soil. That was the end of her story. Or so I thought. Until ten years ago, when I found her. Her remains, hidden deep within abyss. She looked as beautiful as ever. Cindered Shadows, Wolf Pack. Elfric, cease this at once. It is too late. The chalice is filled to its brim with the blood of the four. Should their blood prove insufficient, I will spill even my own blood to finish this. The chalice cannot return her soul, Elfric. It is incapable even of returning the body to life. Be not afraid. Today your mother returns to us. The time has come. Perhaps I am not an equal man to him. But I am here by your side, Citri. 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 The chalice. It absorbed both of them. Oh my god, it's another effing giant dragon. Aberration. What is it? An Uncle beast? Oh, yeah. Dude, it's like Sylvain's brother. That's cool. Citri. Oh, <laughs> look at his teeth. It looks actually pretty cool. So I see. It is just as the last time the ritual was performed. Is this really happening? Elfric turned into that thing? Ugh. It does seem like some kind of sick joke. Now, this is the right of rising? Quite the dangerous ritual, if you ask me. Lady Rhea, monsters have appeared at the cathedral. Could it be? Perhaps his roar drew them there. Everyone who is capable must fight this beast, now! Archbishop Rhea, things ended up this way because of me. Please allow me to make up for it. Yuri... It'll give me a chance to hold up my end of the deal. Let me fight for the church. <laughs> so very like you to steal the glory in the heat of the moment. Elfric used us. He lied to us and attempted to slay us. Despite that, he provided shelter when I had none. We must end things swiftly, for his sake. He's never going to be normal again, is he? For all those years, he tried to make this happen. Bring her back, only to lose himself. It's pretty awful. He made his choice. All we can do is accept it. Let's do all of us a favor and take him out real quick like, yeah? We'll help too. Together we stand, together we fall. Yes, you can rely on us until the very end. Time to lower the curtain on this unfortunate tale. Please act swiftly, but with great care. By my order, stop the Umbral Beast. Stop Elfric. Oh man, I'm actually pumped now. I am legitimately kind of upset it is a dragon, but it's also not a dragon. I don't know. Fire Emblem tradition. What are you gonna do? Anywho. God, I guess we're already at Endgame. I... I was kind of hoping it'd be a little longer. I don't know. Th th things are finally getting good, but... Uh, anyways, uh, <laughs> a little anticlimactic. 
Hey, I know the town's getting assaulted by, uh, you know, monsters and stuff, but we got battalions to fix up. Okay, so we got some extra gold from that map. Let's uh, get rid of all that. And wow, we only got one bully on. That's actually surprising. We could sell some of our additional equipment, like the, you know, iron axe and stuff, but I think we'll be okay. I want to check out what the map is first and foremost. It's just this giant thing. God, oh, we're in the, we're in the cathedral. There's the, there's the statues. Okay, that's actually kind of neat. I like that. Okay, so it's a beast and a dragon. I wonder why they would have that. It's got the, wait, I wonder if we can proc his crest actually. Got vantage, hit, death blow. So yeah, we really want to burst through that first phase. Umbral Leech. He absorbs HP from phantasms, and he bursts phantasms, so it gives additional enemies. Halves all damage taken, negates some abilities. Ugh. Counterattack. Okay. It could be worse, though. These could also be filled up. All right, we got this, dude. I, I want to, like, use everything we got. Also, holy frick. Oh, my God. Big brain play. Edelgard, we don't need you to be this anymore. Just go crazy. With that axe fair, I guess. I don't, I don't know what else is she going to do. Kind of sucks we just bought that mallet, but um, I don't know how high the crit chance is going to be against this thing, but it can't hurt to spend some of our money on crit items, right? The killer lance. Dude, that would be so huge. I'm getting it. That's Dimitri's going to carry us in this chapter. Is there anything else? There's sadly nothing that's super strong against dragons. Uh, We could get a killing edge, I suppose, but really... Violet's okay with a steel sword, I think, at the end of the day. We'll get healing for everybody else, too. Okay, I spent the rest of our materials and our money pretty much upgrading everybody's major weapons. Violet is fine. Balthus is fine. Let's just get to it, man. I can't wait anymore. God, I just... I need to know what type of damage it does. Because both strength and magic are tied. If it goes for our weakest stat, this could be a tough fight. But I guess we'll see. Let's do this. This magnificent cathedral will collapse if this continues for much longer. That abomination sure as hell isn't going to back down. We've got no choice but to go all in. <sighs> He's isolated. Let's surround him. Close the distance in one fell swoop. Don't be rash. Conventional rules don't apply in a battle like this. He's right. We have no way of knowing what that beast is capable of. We must proceed with caution. Right on. I mean, at the end of the day, though, is surrounding it really the worst option? Edelgard's not our tankiest unit anymore because I, I'll cut through. I took away her uh, her class. Don't even know if the tile. Man, I just don't know how to do these boss fights. Byleth is definitely our tankiest member. Let's get that like changed. I mean, he might dodge it. Yeah, we gotta test the waters a little bit. Okay, yeah, he's fine. I just wish I knew what type of damage he did. Chalice of blood. The chalice is full of power. Okay, so he's actually using the chalice as a weapon. Okay, that's fine. I mean, we'll see eventually. But I think, yeah, actually surrounding it's not a bad idea. I'm thinking we just battalion spam. And depending on the formation, right, we just try and destroy all of these in one turn. And then just oh, yeah. pop off because really, what else? What else are we doing right now? Like this is the end. <laughs> this is the end of the game, right? I might. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna dismount. That's not bad. I'm gonna just try steel bow. Get Linhart just to be safe, and then I don't know. Next turn, we're just gonna yep. tear him up. I don't know what it's gonna do, but we know we can live it. Here it comes. It's got like a beard. It's kind of odd. What the? That's also really odd. An illusion. And it looks just like Elfric. I didn't think they'd just look like him. I thought they'd be ghosts. I'm not sure I can fight him. Even if it's not really him. Don't worry, Happy. I can. <laughs> I don't care for him at all. Okay, sounds good. He's got tre- Okay, that's why I want to kill those. The beast can feed off these illusions somehow? Its wounds are healing. How troublesome. That's fine. We'll just- just burn them down. Hopefully they're not too tanky. I couldn't get in range with... Oh, God. That had to hit me. Dang it. Okay, it's not fun. It's 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 okay. Oh, it summoned another? No! Crap! What? How many can he summon? Dump! How strong are these things? So what's the treasure on them? 
Oh, that's good. Wait, that's a concoction? My god, that's awesome! Okay. Wait, they're level 15. Is this a meme? Uh, okay. Um. We can do at least that. God, I'm so happy she can move again. Dog, that's pretty good. Oh my god. This is gonna be a joke. I. Ooh, we gotta be careful though. Let's get Constance nearby. Actually, can you just straight up destroy. Wait, what's it doing? What's its move? Oh my god, look at that crap. That's a big AoE. I don't even know what that move does. Ugh, I want to stop that. I don't want to fa face that if I don't have to. Screw it. At this point, we just get as many battalions on the field as we can. I need this Alfred dead. But luckily for us, that's the one that's drained. I'm going to do that. Hopefully with her. No way are she fighting her. Okay, that's bad. We've never seen Fimba Velter. And we probably never will, because this is infinitely more accurate. Okay. We do list and get Constance just way out of there. Next turn or whatever, we can pop uh, healing. Nah, she can't move any further. Dump! It's the entire area! <sighs> what a drag. I, I didn't use bolting. We might still be able to get a decent gambit boost here. Yeah, that's a 90. Dude, let's just do it. You can't hear me now. Not like this. Not anymore. You really are a damn fool. You know that? I, I can't disagree. This is almost like Petty. Like, dude, she's dead. She wasn't even... Man, I don't know. Because what he's feeling is genuine, I feel. And like, you know, uh, I gotta be careful about this. Probably gonna put you there in case I wanna try another battalion. That is a common thing that people feel. But dog, basing that around your, I don't know. I'm not saying it's unrealistic, but it does seem kind of just odd. God, if I don't hit this, F it. Okay, no dialogue for Edelgard. Pretty sure she would be like, you're ugly. Now eat this barrel. Thank God I hit, okay, cool, cool. Now we just gotta worry about how many I think that's it. No, that's not it. Oh, there's only four. Ooh, that's so easy. Heck yeah, bruh. This fool is dead. What, who are you? Who are What do you think you're doing? Training gauntlets. It's because I like seeing plus four or times four. Oh, crap. That did damage. I was so surprised he even hit me. Wow. All right. That's a KO. We're taking a lot of damage from these things, actually. It might be a good idea to just... Once we get this initial wave down, we're just leaving to Balthus. Hilda, and one other physical attacker to just deal with all of them. I do like they keep dropping those, though. It's quite nice. I'm getting tore up, though. Hold up. Okay. Just chill right here. Nope. I ain't doing that. Let's try from this range. Man, we're just getting beat, though. Ugh, if we do no damage, we can't break it. Okay, it's got to be Hilda, then. No, screw it. At this point, dude, we're taking too much damage. We can't heal everybody. It's got to be an assault troop. Oh, man, that looks so cool. I like the formation we got going on. Everybody but Claude helped out. Okay, so shields are down. The attack will be stopped, and now we can just go crazy on it, right? Pretty darn sure. I'm going to move you over here just so we're a little more spread out on the map. You know what? Actually, wow. Spreading out did work. Good job, guys. And, yeah, totally stunned. Come on, Hoppy. I need a big crit. Biggest one you got. Don't have Thimba Velter, sure, but I've never said that move right in my life. <laughs> Let's just try death. He's gone now. Transformed into that thing. Sometimes the world's too horrible to wrap my head around. Yeah, especially this place, man. I I want to sympathize with him because I think the pro big problem with this DLC, at least for me, was that they do a lot of telling, but not any showing at all. I mean, literally everyone's just like, oh yeah, Alfred, coolest guy ever. The millisecond you meet him. Which I suppose is realistic, but man, it just... Doesn't feel genuine? I don't know how to describe it. It's very odd. I'm not trying to undercut the, you know, quality of the game, because I legitimately did really like this. The maps are the selling point, though, for me personally. We're doing nothing for damage here. It's going for you next turn. That's okay, I guess. I mean... Every oh my gosh. It's actually nice. Whew. Okay. Hopefully uh, Hilda can get a crit. That'd be really nice. She still doesn't have Monster Breaker, though. Luckily for us, though, Edelgard does. Steel Axe doing... Wait, Spike? Hold up. What are the... What are these crit chances? Hilda might just beat this thing herself. Get it, girl! Come on! Yeah! 
We, we started this let's play with insane Hilda crits. We're ending it that way. I like it. I like it. Okay. Next turn. I guess, yeah, another spawn. Ooh, two at a time. Oh, God. Two at the same time. However, we'll be Cove. <laughs> We're fine. We can even, like, use the uh, healing one, maybe. Oh, I, I unequipped that. Bummer. Uh, 30 and 30. It's actually not enough. How are you doing? Okay. Uh, that's a bad idea. Instead, let's maybe, um... Ugh, this is rough. Who do I dedicate to, de to dealing with these guys? I think it has to be the casters, because according to the thing, right? If casters hit him, he gets more res. I'm pretty sure. Or, no, that was... Uh, no, that was the uh, other version. Okay, so he doesn't have that. So m magic people can hit him. It's the only problem is the counterattack. It's gigantic. 41 and they d the mages are too slow. Frick. Well, when in doubt, Sword of Creator. Let's try it. Oh my god, Silver Sword is actually better. What? Wow. And zero crit. Okay. I'm fine with that. Let's do it. It will eventually get vantage. Nina, remember that. And we can just heal up Byleth next turn. It'll all be fine. Everything, everybody else really. Uh, this is so tricky. I'm going to try and attack these guys from three tiles away just to minimize the damage. They're level 15, dog. That's... They shouldn't be able to do that much. How can you even attack me from that far away? What do you got? I think... Yeah, recovered there. Which is well kind of a shame. Yuri's literally just the teleport bot and occasional healer. Man, these guys are tougher than I was expecting, though, man. This bites! Ugh! Do we just hope we don't get hit? Okay, or get a crit. Yeah, that works. Cool. I need him to focus on Edelgard, but she doesn't have a battalion. I guess keeping the shield on her is fine. Assuming he does do physical damage, though, I think we can deal with it. Yes! Oh my god. She shows up to... What? I guess, yeah, 25 times 3 is that. Holy cow. But we got doubled. Oh god, that's spooky. Maybe I should take the shield off? I don't know. Whatever. Uh, You have Monster Breaker. Oh my god, he's got Monster Piercer. Is it time for the Killer Lance? It might be just about that time. Let's do it. Come on, Dimitri. You got us. Proc it. Yeah! Okay. Maybe should have saved it. We're already on the last HP bar. Holy crap. No, we're not. Frick, I can't count. Dump. Okay. Uh, Move over here just to be safe, I guess. Heal Edelgard from all the way over here. And then, oh my god. Everybody's proccing everything. This is awesome. Okay. Then, uh, you... No, fight the tiny, <laughs> tiny one. <laughs> so is this like Alfred's mini me? If this is, I, I don't know. Anyway, they have one percent crit. That is obnoxious. I would hate to lose somebody at this point. I'm just getting out of range of this guy. So I'm pretty sure they're gonna prioritize going over there. Let's try bolting on the tiny one. That would ugh, really one HP. Whatever. What else are we gonna use it on? We can't use it against the big dragon. And then whoever's left over can just deal with that. Oh, that's going for out. Oh, no. We got to get him healed. How can we do that? Oh, we got to use a battalion then. Frick. Uh, Gambit. That'll draw aggro, right? Please, for the love of God. Work how I think you work. Maybe Balthus can dodge it? Why can Balthus get doubled by this thing? There we go. Okay, that's better than nothing. We know she has a million HP, right? Okay. Just do that here. No reason not to. Unfortunately, Claude's not really getting a lot of action here. He's a little too fragile. Uh, yeah, wow. Go Hilda. Shoot. We'll just sit here in case more spawn. It's not bad. The mini bow actually has super high crit. Do we start working on the next HP bar? No, I just gotta chill. We still have people we have to heal up. Who do we have to heal up? Actually, it's just really Balthus. Screw it. I like to play a little dangerously. And it's 0% crit. Let's do it. We're getting crazy crits. Let's keep it going, boys! Hey! What's up? 15. Not, not. Oh, it looks so nasty. Reminds me a lot of Duma. A little bit. Not totally in the design, but man. All right, so assuming, yeah. He, he just can't crit anybody. That's crazy. So she's a little low, but it's fine. He spawned over there, which I'm cool with. It's charging that special again. So even if we... Frick, can I see what the special does? 
don't think so. Oh, yeah, you can't. Okay, it's right there. Full body attack that deals... Wait, so it does percent damage. That's not even that bad. If that does what I think it does, that's easy. Heck yeah, bro. Okay, uh, let's keep attacking you. I'm far away. We have the res to tank it. It's cool. Uh, I sure hope I'm right, and that's how it works. I mean, as you all know, I have a tendency to misread things when we do some of these videos, but we'll be okay, I think. Uh, let's get out of there. I'm so scared, bro. Even though she has a million Volanaries, I'm just going to top her off. Because if it doesn't do enough... It, no, okay, if it calculates damage differently, like, what is 25% of two? What if it just rounds up? You never know. I mean, that would be stupid math. And we do have... Uh, chances to do it again, but it's, uh, you know, do-overs. I don't want it to have to come to that. We can, we can win sweep here. For no counter-attack. It's three damage, but, you know, we're getting crits like no end! Oh my god, yes! I guess his luck is really bad? I don't, I don't know. Let's chill right there. Uh, I want, I want this HP bar gone. No, you gotta, you gotta chill out, girl. Oh, I wouldn't give her a concoction. Are you effing kidding me? Dang it! That's actually kind of big! Crap. Ugh, and I can't move to her to trade. It's okay. We're tearing up here. 27. I mean, we might as well take it. Aw, oh, could use the combat art for higher crit. Wait, he has one crit? Dump. It's fine. We're all gonna be really low after this. I think if we just keep up the barrage of damage. Oh, no, I can't on her yet. Dump. Oh, snap. We can, he we can heal this way. Nice. Let's do that. Even if it if he hits Balthus, it'll be okay. And then we'll just end it, turn off on... Oh my god, we have more. We have another battalion. Oh yeah! Okay. Ruptured Heaven. It's not doing amazing. Should probably save that for last. Bane of Monsters. How's that looking? Really, really good. I think that'll have to... Okay, I don't know what's coming after this. So I gotta be careful not to overextend. I think that's an okay play. Because our, our crest might proc. Let's see what happens. This is getting a little old. I mean... I like it, don't get me wrong, but still, this is... And we got the crest. My god, Byleth is a beast. Okay, so... Your call. Do we do this? Oh, wow, he has gambits. Let's do one of those. Might as well at this point. What do we have to lose from it? Nothing. And then we'll just get... Oh, that looks so effing cool! Yes! We got it to happen at least once. It would have been perfect if Yuri was there, but oh well. What are you gonna do? I was going to Claude, but uh, the whole thing gets hit, so it's not a huge deal. Can I do... I can actually do five with steel. Dog. We were hitting every single one. This RNG is ridiculous. Okay, I don't even know what to say. I'm not even remotely scared. Bro, we're gonna end this super easily. What if he doesn't go for that? No, he has to go for the super attack, bro. The game would be lying if, if that wasn't the case. I don't think we do anything here. We just chill. There's no reason to. Yeah, let's just chill out. End our turn. I hope I did everything correctly. That's not how you end your turn. There we go. Okay. Here comes the big super attack. Look out! It's going specifically on Claude, but it hits the entire room. Uh, well, yeah, that would hit the entire room. It's pretty big. <laughs> it looks so goofy. He's like, huh? His teeth, that is. Okay. Um, what? That's stupid! That's... It's okay. It'll go still in range. We're good. <laughs> After using Staggering Blow, Umbral Surge. Number of beasts seems to be faltering. During next player phase, the beast will have reduced crit avoid. What? What the heck was that? We all got moved to different positions. No, Byleth's all the way down there. Crap. It's some brand of spatial distortion magic. I haven't the faintest how to defend against it. Damn! Don't let that thing catch you alone. It's too risky. Yeah, don't be reckless. Stand united. Uh, unfortunately, everybody's so low. All right, two spawn. It's not a huge deal. Can I... Ah, oh, man, I don't think I can reach. Who can I get in range of for this? Dang it, bro! That's so random! How do you even account for that? What was my hint? But it can't counterattack this turn, right? I read at least that correctly. My god, we're gonna crit this thing like crazy. 
Do we even try to end it this turn? I think we can. Hold up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We can't get Byleth. He's too far away. Demon, you're kidding me. <sighs> All right, let's Hail Mary it. We got to just try everything we got. Don't do it from that range. Jesus Christ, hopefully this works. Um, Gambit's whatever damage. Let's just kill her Lancet. With a monster piercer. That's 52 to crit. Please, for the love of God, hit this, Dimitri. You got this, dude. You got it. Come on, we need big damage. Yes, we have big damage. Get it. Woo! A third of his HP bar, one turn. That's what I like to see. Get out of there. We want to counterattack. Okay. Holy crap. If but oh my god. This is what I get for relying on Byleth too much. You sure? At this point, dude, just give him everything you got. 20, 25, 40. 40 is actually huge. Screw the battalions. We need crits. Yes! Yes! I can't believe the game's trolling me this hard. Okay. I was somehow expecting more damage, but it's okay. Um. Doesn't he get buffed if we do... Uh, no, I don't... Okay, we're gonna we're gonna save Magic Caster. No, I just did a Magic Caster. What am I saying? Let's get you in there. Cutting Gale's pretty high crit chance. Yeah. Is there anything else? We seriously can't double this fool. It's bull. Whatever. Get it. You got this, dude. You got this. <laughs> we're gonna do it! We're almost there. Hopefully the apparitions don't count. But I think Byleth can reach one of those. Careful. Um. Mini bow. That's pretty great crit chance. Even if it doesn't... <sighs> 10 damage is 10 damage. I'm doing it. And we'll get let Edelgard do the last. Oh my god, he did it? That's actually really surprising. He has tons of skill. Or dex. Or whatever the crap the stat is. Okay. 33. What's more important? A 6 crit or 2? I mean, in the long run, that's more damage. I think we gotta do that. Come on, hit the other one, though. We got this. Yes! Okay. Now if Edelgard just... Connects with anything. Wait, can we rally Edelgard? Is Balthus in range? Yeah. Oh, wait, no. It's not. Crap. Um. Yuri can also hit. Okay. That's really nice. Steel. I just want to see if he has any dialogue with Yuri. That'd be kind of sick. Okay, four. Dog, math was not my... Actually, math was my major in college. What am I talking about? I have no excuse. It's okay. We can do it. Wait, what? Are the squares different? No, they're not. Okay, that was just the animation. Doesn't have... Oh, yeah, he already attacked him, right? That was incredibly disappointing. I can't lie. Okay. Uh, Hilda. Man, we're putting a lot on Edel Edelgard's shoulders, though. Will you, 80? I don't know, girl. That's slim odds. Frick! Monster Breaker. Dog. We're... We're counting on her so much here. Because, yeah, no one else. It's got to be. Constance can lead. She, we, she has Svimba Velter. That's super high crit. Dude, I'm literally. Because if we don't, someone dies next turn. We're putting all of we're putting all of this on such. Ugh. No, nah, I can't do that. We just need Edelgard to hit. If these fires do it, we're good. Okay. I'm doing this first. Edelgard first. We, oh my god, I could have rallied. Frick. Okay, it doesn't matter. Edelgard. You're easily my favorite lord. Please hit this. No matter what. You got this. Crit it. She didn't crit. But she got the crest! Yes! Thank god. That was some sick irony. We finally beat this nightmarish DLC. Jesus Christ. Whew. That was... That was tough, actually. Wait, what? I mean... Okay, sure. Yeah, why not? It is finished. Yeah, about time. Jesus. Well done, everyone. Because of you, her restless soul has finally found peace. Professor, I imagine you have much on your mind. Not really. Oh, yeah. My mom. <laughs> That's kind of important. So, what... Well, What's the deal there? I was there the day she brought you forth into this world. Citri had always been frail. Giving birth proved to be too much for her in the end. On that fated day, 
It looked as though neither of you would survive. In those final moments, she spoke, saying, My heart, give it to my child. Wait a minute. It, so the thing in... No way. So the thing with... And the Black Eagle ending, what? So Rhea, we weren't an exper- What the crud? Then it- If what she's saying is actually true, she has no point to lie at this point. What the crud? So that's why his heart doesn't beat. Why? That is correct. The heart that lies within your chest is none other than hers. Then I'm ha- What? It was the only way that you could be saved. I thought it was a crest stone. But Citri loved others, much as a human might. And I loved her in return. So, how the, yeah, how the crud she end up in abyss? Like, why didn't she just bury her? Th then she's not even buried in the Garrig Mock. That's... <sighs> Citri looked upon me as though I was her mother. And I wished for her to have a bright future. I would not have her buried in the cold, dark soil. Prior to her funeral, I arranged for a fake burial. Afterward, I brought her body to Abyss, where I would sometimes visit her. I never thought that anyone, especially Elfric, would find her. I did not expect for such a tragedy to ensue. Boss, there's something you've got to tell me. Was Elfric really just using us all that time? How should I know? I mean, he always acted that way around me. Like we were a means to an end. But the church records indicate he founded the Ashen Wolf House 15 years ago. He mentioned he found Citri 10 years ago. So it seems he really did mean well at first. Dang. That's... It's actually kind of sad. What's done is done. He's gone, and we're here. That's what matters now. You're always so quick to adapt to change, Happy. I should follow your example. <laughs> yeah, you always get to the heart of things quickly. Right then, I've got a lot to take care of now. I need to fill the church in on all the details about how things actually played out. And with my people freed from the monastery prison, they'll need to be accounted for. Good luck with that whole mess. I'll be rooting for you from afar. Surely you'll let us know if there is any way at all we can help. We'd be just thrilled. Hell, if you want, your people can be my people. <laughs> use some good mercenaries to watch my back. Can you afford them, though, Balthus? Enough already. I get it. It's no less than you deserve. What you have sown, now you shall reap. You made your bed, now shut up about it, pal. <laughs> anyway, what do you figure will happen to Abyss? The church will want to step in, no doubt. You got me. After everything that's happened, things can't stay the same. The church will probably assign an official to oversee things. Hopefully whoever they choose knows how to get along with Abyssians well. Let's worry about all that some other time, yeah? I could really use a tall drink and a long sleep. I'm with you. I heard in places I didn't even know could hurt. It has been a terribly long night indeed. One I won't ever forget. A terribly long night, but a beautiful morning. <laughs> you mean to say that you are disbanding us? Yes. After speaking with the Cardinals, my decision is final. The Ashen Wolf House was originally established for youths who were in need of the church's protection. Somewhere along the way, that intent was corrupted, and it ultimately became a cage for you. The Ashen Wolves are officially disbanded. You can consider this a graduation of sorts. You can doll this up by calling it graduating, but you're the one who sent me to Abyss to begin with. Oh. Wow. Now you waltz in here and tell us to just go live our lives as if none of this ever happened? Yeah, how's she gonna do that? You may continue living in Abyss, of course. Oh, okay. <laughs> Abyss will always be a refuge for those who need it most. 
Well, I guess it all works out then. Wow, Ray is... Man. I, in a way, I guess I had her all wrong. I, I thought she was keeping them down there for different reasons, but... No, she's actually kind of nice sometimes. Your chains have been unbound. You are free to live as you wish now. You ask me, this feels like good timing. This sounds pretty all right, Rhea. After all I have been through, I must say I feel immense gratitude at the prospect of living freely. You're just going to let me go? While I was working with the church, I still did some unsavory things. You have already been judged for your transgressions, Yuri. You have slain the undeserving. The weight of that is yours to bear. You have time to contemplate your actions now. That is punishment enough. Shoot, dude, he got off scot free. <laughs> What's with the woe is me act? She's saying you're a free man. But he still feels bad about all the people he had to kill. Meanwhile, I probably killed half the population of Fodlin in this one DLC alone. True enough. It's up to me to determine how I'll live my life now. How I'll make up for what I've done. You made up your mind quickly, despite having ample time to think it through. Oh snap, no way. <laughs> Someone of my many talents must make decisions in short order. I'm in high demand after all. Are they joining the school? Please! The Ferdiad Royal School of Sorcery demands my presence post haste. How can I deny them? Soon, the name Nouvelle shall be renowned all throughout the Imperial capital. Prepare yourselves. Didn't you already attend that school? Leaving and going back seems... <laughs> well, good luck with that. <laughs> Come on, Linhart. She's trying her best. Maybe I'll try to see my family again. It's been forever, but now seems like as good a time as any to do that. The whole thing might be a drag, though, so maybe I'll come straight back to Abyss. <laughs> I think I'll... Yeah. Yep. I'll find a way to hit it big. Make tons of money. Sounds so easy when you say it like that. It's about time the indebted king of grappling finally paid down all those damn debts. You could always ask my brother to help you out. Seems like a good way to go, really. Borrow from Holst? That's a hard no. Wouldn't dare to trouble my best pal like that. <laughs> He's too ashamed to ask. <laughs> That's enough about me. What are you going to do now, boss? Maybe join the academy? Yeah. Who knows? For now, I'll take some time to think. Oh. Actually, I like that more. We don't get a definitive answer. My main concern at this point is taking care of my people back in my hometown. You mean you'll continue your former line of work? No need to beat around the bush. And yeah, that's the plan. It's what I'm best at. But I can approach things differently now. Change how I live. Find ways to thrive in peace, you know? Makes sense to me. I wish you all the best. Thanks, friend. Right back at you. We both deserve to live our lives freely. I may end up back home after all this, but I worry about how my rogues here would fare without a boss. Always worrying about everyone but yourself. Stop with that already, yeah? Don't worry, Yuri. I'll look after your town of really depressed people for you. There you go, being cute again. Oh, stop. Though I'm certain if you're around, Abyss and everyone in it will be just fine. We'll keep an eye on Abyss as well. Isn't that right, you two? Absolutely. That place is a treasure trove of secrets. Just try to keep me away. I trust your motives are not all so selfish, Claude. And yes, we promise to protect Abyss in your absence. Boss! Boss! You can't just leave us high and dry like this! Where will we go? What will we do? I should have known. Humans are adaptable creatures. I'll sort it out just fine. <laughs> Relax, will ya? We all know Yuri's not the type to abandon his pals. He's a guy who always turns up when he's needed. Hell, we should all be taking notes from him. The world's a dreary place. We could all use a little help now and again. As long as we're all here for each other as true friends, we can live our lives to the fullest. That sounded really generic, but yeah, if you say so. You heard me. You're all my friends. You matter. You always will. That seems like a good note to end on. Sure does. Get you later, pals. I mean, friends. With that, 
I bid you farewell. <laughs> and so it is. Until next time, friend. And with that, we're all done. I, uh, man, I kind of liked that. And we can now recruit Yuri in part one of the main story, which uh, hopefully will give him a little more, I don't know, room to grow. I'm just going to take a little second to just kind of talk about the DLC and my impressions of it. So, man, oh, man, a lot of reused assets. I was hoping there'd be different maps and... I won't lie, my expectations were kind of let down because I thought it'd be a new route's worth of content, but six or seven chapters and the, the final boss was yet again a giant dragon. <laughs> I don't know. There was a lot I was thinking this was going to be, and I think that's more of a lesson for myself to not get my hopes up. But despite that, what we actually got, especially on hard mode, really challenging, but really fun. I... I'm super into Fire Emblem again because of this DLC, because of the map design. Uh, maps 2 and 4, easily my favorite. 6 was okay, but man, I just kind of trivialized it with uh, Retribution, <laughs> which is more on me. But uh, I really enjoyed this, and I think I, I, I kind of want to try harder difficulties in Fire Emblem from now on. I mean, I can't say for sure what day we will do the other routes in Fire Emblem Three Houses, but it's definitely something I'm warming up to because... This was a whole heck of a lot of fun, and, uh, man, I, I won't lie, though, some of the characters from the house, or, you know, the Ashen Wolves, I thought they'd be a lot more interesting, really, they, they really don't get to say a lot or do a lot in this DLC, which kind of stinks, the story was definitely the, the worst part of it, but how, how well of a Fire Emblem story can you tell in seven parts? I don't know if we'll ever get another side story. I mean, the option down here does kind of make me believe that one day they might do one again. But uh, as a standalone Fire Emblem adventure, not the best. But, you know, the part of the DLC is you get to recruit those students and use them in other maps. So that's cool. But, yeah, you made it this far. Thanks a ton for watching. I, I really like Fire Emblem. And I also really like you. You, the person listening all the way past the credits. Actually, there's no credits, but... Thanks again, guys, for all the amazing support. More Fire Emblem to come. Maybe sooner than you think. But for right now, we're stopping here. And yeah, see you guys in the next Let's Play. Bye.